What is going on guys and welcome back to another fishing adventure. So today I went into town to pick up this one little screw and I ended up coming home with this truck. <laughs> Check out that catfish. Are you freaking kidding me right now? Oh boy. Well, let's go ahead and check out my brand new truck. Want to? It's not new, but it's new to me, so I'm gonna call it brand new. Oh man, that thing is sexy. Let's check it out. So here is my 2018 Chevrolet Silverado 1500 LT. This truck is exactly what I was wanting. I said I went to Borger to go pick up a screw, and I came home with a truck. That is true. I was not expecting to buy a truck today, but I was expecting to buy a truck a few weeks ago. I went to the bank, I got pre-approved and all that stuff, and I went and looked for a truck, but I could not find one that I wanted, so uh, I waited. On vehicles, I get what I want. If it has one thing wrong with it, I'm out. But uh, this truck, this truck was perfect. And I just happened to be driving by the car lot today, I saw it, I went and looked at it, and I got it. The car dealership guy said that it was the quickest deal he's ever done. I was in and out and home with this new truck. And man, I freaking love it. I love it so much already. It had to be white. I wanted black rims. And a plus, it already has window tinted on it, so it's perfect. Absolutely perfect. So this is my new adventure rig. I want to put a truck bed back here on the back of it deck it all out put a bed back there and be able to camp in it just like I did in my Nissan Xterra so this is my baby right here my Nissan Xterra I've had this car for a long time now as you can see white black rims it's kind of a theme I have to have it you will not see me ever drive any other color vehicle but here it is my Nissan Xterra I've done a lot to this car put solar panels on top of it there's a sleeping platform back there I'm kind of sad to say, but I'm going to be selling my Nissan Xterra. We're getting rid of it. I don't need it anymore because now we have the truck. There's nothing wrong with my Xterra. I still love it. I will always love Xterras, but you know, I just, it was time. Time for something new, time for a change. The reason I got a truck was almost really to pull a bigger bass boat. My Nissan Xterra pulled this thing out great. I had no problems getting out of the ramp, but I don't know, man. It just got in my head. I have a way bigger bass boat now, so I need a bigger vehicle, so I got one. But man, holy crap. Oh, this is exciting. But since we got a new truck, I need to go ahead and clean out the old car. There is a lot of stuff in here. Fishing poles, camping stuff, cameras, GoPros. I actually want to test out if a fishing pole can fit inside the truck. That's one worry I did have with having a truck. With my SUV, I have all this space up here to throw rods. I even have these straps up here. But let's try to go ahead and throw this cycle stick into the truck. This is a 7 foot 2 rod, so somewhat short compared to some of the rods I have. Obviously I'm going to have to go through the front and out the back. It should fit. Oh, the Okuma Psycho Stick. One of my favorite rods ever. Oh, no problem, dude. We still have like two feet of room to fit. So, I mean, it's kind of annoying. It might be in the way, but from now on, that's what I'm gonna have to do for my rods. They're too nice to throw in the back. But once I do get my camper bed on the truck, they will be getting stored in the back of that. But for now, that's what we're gonna have to do. Let me show you all the back seats. Check this out, boom. Got some pretty big seats back here. A lot of room. Look at all these freaking door pockets. Why do you need so many pockets on the door? <laughs> That's awesome. That's gonna hold camera gear. It can hold anything. Fishing gear. Anything. Pretty. Freaking sweet. All black. Decked out in black. Oh baby. Oh baby. I love it. If y'all can't tell, I freaking love this truck. But there is the truck. I'm gonna over the tailgate and then we will put everything that is in the Xterra on the tailgate just to get the Xterra all cleaned out. So 
So I bought this bag for traveling on the airplane for my laptops and camera gear and all that stuff and it was too small. My laptop was too big to even fit in this. So now I think that this is going to be my new catch and cook bag. Now, I can easily grab this bag, have it on the boat at any time, and easily do catch and cooks whenever I want. I wonder if there's like a pre-made organization thing for back seats. Something to uh, just store all your gear in. You would think there would be. I'll do some research and see what I can find. Heater, smoke detector, a light for the John boat. And a handle for the drum boat. That needs to go back in the drum boat. Let's get these golf clubs out of here. Me and Devin do occasionally play some golf. We're not very good, but we enjoy it. It's always fun. More rods, more rods. Okuma Seymars going in the truck. And the last rod is the Okuma Guide Select Cranking Rod with the Helios SX bait caster. This is one of my favorite bait casters I've ever used in my life. This thing came out of the box ready to go. I would put this in the truck, but it has the treble hooks on there. And I can guarantee you that is going into the seat. Dude, no way. That's where my freaking sunglasses went. What? I thought I lost these. I already have a new pair, but heck yeah. A jerk bait that actually fell out of the giveaway bag. That is supposed to be for a giveaway. So I guess that is going to be today's giveaway lure. I will pick a comment later on in this video, but damn, damn. <laughs> bug spray, shampoo, bug spray, bug spray, more bug spray. Guys, these Texas mosquitoes are no joke. You gotta be prepared. <laughs> <laughs> I am always prepared. Skate tool. I don't even know the last time I went skateboarding. This is cool. This is how I edit in the car. So this just hooks up to your steering wheel like so. And you have a desk. How freaking awesome is that? I need to go on more trips. I have this awesome car set up and I don't even take that many trips. This year or next year, we're taking more trips, dang it, for sure. I want to fish new lakes because to be honest my local lake it kind of sucks it sucks going to like lake fork or even lake havasu and catching huge bass and coming home and catching nothing so this year i definitely plan to travel more soon rubik's cube mm. jesus clean out your car adam so now we got the battery, a jacket, I'll throw that with the clothes. Oh dang, Adam Ryan. Guys, I had merch for a little while, but the company I was getting it from was horrible. The quality was trash. So I took it all down. I did not like it. I'll probably do merch again some other day, but I just want to make sure the quality of it is high because this right here, not acceptable. That just looks horrible. And that's a big company that a bunch of YouTubers use too, so. We got some of the very first Adam Ryan decals I ever made in here. There's one. We got quite a few in there. Bam. Well, she's all cleaned out, folks. Well, besides these rod holders up here. If you're wondering if I'm sad about getting rid of my Xterra, the answer is no, not really. Uh, I do have a lot of memories with this car, but it's hard to be sad when I got the excitement of this new truck right here. So, I mean, it's hard to be sad seeing this beautiful truck. Look at all these white cars we have. My sisters, my sisters, parents, and then mine, plus my other white truck. White is just the way to go, man, I'm telling you. Now 
now we need to get out this box. I feel like my channel is just taking things apart and putting things back together. Is that how y'all feel? I'm always building something or taking something apart. So I got the inside all wiped down and vacuumed. I took out my battery, it is now there. Now it is time to put the seats back. Oh, the stair is back to being boring. But I still need to take off the solar panel, so. Guess I'll start working on that, which is gonna suck. All right, so I got all of the wiring out for the solar panel. It was a lot easier to take out than put in, that is for sure. But we're done with the inside, let's shut that. And now we have 12 of these bolts to take off and it takes forever. It is 10.55. All right, the last nut. Oh, we are done. It is 12, 12 a.m. So I can't get this thing off my roof by myself. It's just too big and awkward. So I'm going to call it a night and we'll take this off in the morning. Okay, so it is the next day. It is 2 p.m. I got the solar panel off of my car. I also got the rest of my box from Nate's Custom Boats. So we'll open that and go through that today. Put that together. But uh, yeah, I'm about to run to the car wash, get the car washed, and then we can slap on a for sale sticker. Boom. It's official, we're selling the car. It's almost ready. I try to go get all this bird poop off and we'll be good to go. But guys, it's time to say our goodbyes. This may be the last time we see her. But yeah guys, that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. A little spontaneous truck buy. But guys, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I need to pick a winner. Dang it. Okay, so today's winner is going to get this jerk bait. So let's go ahead and randomly pick a comment. Bam, right there. Diesel fumes, Adam. Them fish are messing with everyone. No one is catching any. I know what you mean, man. I have not caught a fish in a while, which sucks. Diesel Fumes, 1982, you are the winner. Dude, thank you for commenting. I always see your comments, you're awesome. So today you're gonna win the jerk bait and of course the sticker. And I'm actually going to do a second winner today because Joe Nobody, the very first winner, has never replied to my comment, never messaged me on Instagram. Guys, if you want to get your prize, you have to message me on Instagram. That is the only private way to communicate. So if you don't do that, I, or I cannot get your address and I cannot ship you your prize. So let's pick one more winner for this right here. I already shipped off everything else yesterday, but let's go ahead and pick one more. Boom. Jay Ramos. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. That's awesome, man. You got to fish with Becca. That was awesome, man. Becca was cool. Becca caught a lot of fish. She's a great fisherman and she's cool, but yeah. So Jay Ramos, you are the winner of, the new winner of the Kytex and the Adam Ryan decal. So two winners for the day, but guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Also guys, thank you so much for watching my videos, liking and commenting. You guys are awesome. And because of you guys, I can afford this truck. I can buy a boat. And I get to go fishing every day. It's all because of you guys. Because you guys watch my videos, I get to chase my dream and live out my dream every single day. So once again, thank you so much. You guys are amazing. If y'all want to win a giveaway lure, all you have to do is comment below and I will be picking a comment in the next video. So guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.